Hey guys, Justin here from Aqua Electric. We're here in Isola, Slovenia to test this new E-Jet tender. It's an all electric tender made for the yacht industry. Let's go check it out. My name is Iga Yarts. I'm the founder and CEO of E-Jet Electric Yacht Tenders. Uh, I started this company, let's say, four or five years ago when we started the development of our first uh, prototype. This is the second boat that we made, so we introduced some amazing new improvements on this boat and we'll go for a ride with it, so you'll, you'll be able to experience it. What's That's one sad. of the features of, let's say, an electric yacht yeah, tender? The, the thing that we are already uh, starting to develop with some of our partners from uh, the yacht industry is to use the tender as, let's say, as a, as a power bank. So during the night, you could use the 46 uh, kilowatt hours of battery from the tender to power all the appliances, air conditioning, et cetera, et cetera, on the big boat. And then let's say in the morning, when everybody wakes up, you turn on the generator on a boat, you can charge back the tender, and you can also use the electricity on the on the on the main vessel. That's amazing. So yeah. you can basically use your tender it's as a, a night bank. generator yeah. to power yeah. everything on the boat. Yeah, yeah, That's, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's fantastic. Yeah, and this is the whole ecosystem that we want to introduce to the market because, as I said, the electric proportion is not just electric, it just brings so much, a lot of benefits to, to the end user, of course. But it's electric, it can't be as fun as a, a Oh, diesel. yeah, it is, it is, because the, the goal was not to make just an electric tender, we really wanted to have high performance on the tender. So uh, with this one, uh, we can produce, with the standard model, it produces 60 kilowatts, uh, but we also offer our upgrade, uh, which uh, which gives us 70 kilowatts of continuous power, which is really phenomenal. You'll see. <laughs> so should we take it for a spin yeah, and yeah, find let's out? Go. Let's oh. go. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> okay. So we're out here on the E-Jet 4X. It's my first time driving an electric jet tender. Let's see how this thing operates. So on this E-Jet, this throttle system is by NT Systems. They have a really nice ergonomic throttle uh, that has this locking mechanism up forward. So you just push this up. You can hear it kick into drive. I can tell you right off the bat, you're not missing anything with the E-Jet 4X. This thing has got plenty of grunt, plenty of power. It's super fun to drive. It's just as, as responsive as any other gas tender. If not more, this thing is a blast. The other thing that is pretty cool is that it seems like, you know, a lot of companies are saying electric boats are totally silent. I've never heard a totally silent electric boat. This one makes some really cool noises. I'm going to try to put the mic up to the <laughs> battery box so we just have a listen. You put it in drive. So one of the other benefits of jets is that you can sort of do an emergency stop like you can't you cannot do with a regular outboard motor. If you're going forward with an outboard and you suddenly throw it into reverse, most likely what's going to happen is it's going to stall the outboard. With a water jet, I can go straight back into reverse and do a sort of like, we call it emergency stop. That's because it drops a bucket over the jet stream and reroutes the jet back under the boat. Talk me through the console. What do we have here? So on the console, First thing you'll see are the control panels for the lights. So underwater lights, cabin lights, navigation lights, and uh, also bilge one. On the right side, this is the power button. Uh, with this button, you turn on all the, the, you put the boat into standby mode. So when you put it in a standby mode, 
uh, the screen will turn on, you'll be able to operate uh, audio equipment on the tender, you'll be able to turn on lights and, and all the 12 volt systems. And then when uh, you want to drive, you need to have your key card, your RFID key card. Okay. And you press the card next to the throttle lever. And this gives the signal to the lever that the um, tender um, turns on. Let's say it uh, unlocks. Yeah. And when that happens, uh, the tender has uh, power on the drivetrain and you can start uh, moving and driving. Okay. Uh, then other features that we also have on the display of, of course, you can see all the, the parameters from the tender. So speed, uh, RPM, temperature of the motor uh, controller, and also from the battery pack. And uh, the best feature that we introduced is uh, driving mode. So you can go into the menus and switch to driving modes where you can select in which mode you want to drive. So we have three options, eco, normal and power. So in a lower driving mode, let's say eco, the, the system will automatically reduce the, the maximum output power of a tender. So it will be, let's say, easier to operate for someone who has less experience or you want to save a little bit of battery uh, and you don't want to, to push the tender as, as fast as, as it's, possible, it's possible to drive. Uh, and the third thing maybe that I want to mention is navigation. So on navigation, you can see your uh, exact position. So it's a lot easy, safer to, to, let's say, when you're driving at night, when you don't know your exact position, it's very nice to have a map to see, okay, I'm on the middle of the channel. I'm not going too close uh, towards the, the, the land. For sure. And uh, let's say another thing that I, play, I wish to mention is uh, audio control. So you can connect your phone to, to, to our system. You can play whatever songs you, you want. And you can also control audio directly from the display. So you can see which song is playing. You can skip songs. You can control the volume. And we also have another uh, control uh, panel to, to control audio from the side. So when you're lying, let's say, in a nice valley and you're lying in front and you don't want to stand up and change audio, you can just use these buttons to, mm -hmm. to, to control it. So it's like an easy, uh, fast access to, to audio controls. Yeah. yeah. So since we're out here with the founder of the company, uh, why start a boat company? why there, there's plenty of other things to do why well, start an electric honestly i was always very passionate about electric uh, electric transport or let's say or cars or boats everything what was electric was interesting to me and i wanted to include that interest towards electric propulsion with my love uh, which is sea boats etc etc and i wanted to connect everything together and build a product which I believe is the future of, of this industry, let's say on the tender market. But of course, our, our goals are to electrify the whole industry. The, you never know, maybe in 10, 20 years, we'll be building super yachts on electric propulsion. You never know. You never know. <laughs> you never know. For sure. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, we're, we're out here filming, but we're also still having a lot of fun. And this is kind of what boats can do for you is we're out here, it's quiet, it's peaceful. Uh, you're never really working nice. when you're big, making boats. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs>its propulsion system. So it's only moving water through the jets as I'm in gear. That's all for the eJet 4X. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.